Hello friends, in this video we will see more problems related to the pipes and system. Okay. So let us consider there are three pipes are there A, B and C. So they can fill the tank in 12 hours, 15 hours and 20 hours respectively. So the, they can fill the tank in 12 hours, 15 hours, 20 hours respectively. So A is open all the time. A is open all the time. A is open all the time. And B and C are open for open for one hour open for one hour alternatively each alternatively so the the tank will be the tank will be filled in the tank will be filled in ok how many hours we have to find so A, B and fill the tank C and fill the tank in 12 hours, 15 hours, 20 hours respectively A is open all the time and B and C are open for 1 hour each alternatively alternatively so the tank will be filled the tank will be filled in how many hours ok so in all the three cases A is filling, B is filling and C is filling ok uh, in all the cases the tank is the same and the capacity of the tank is also same so I am going to take the capacity of the tank as the LCM of 12, 15, 20 so the LCM of 12, 15, 20 is going to be 60 so I take the capacity of the tank capacity of the tank is equal to 60 units ok the capacity of the tank I take as a 60 units ok so capacity of the tank is 60 units that means A is filling 12 in 12 hours so the total capacity is 60 units is filling in 12 hours that means A is filling 5 units per hour ok and B is filling in 15 hours ok so that means it is filling 4 units per hour C is filling in 20 hours that means C is filling 3 units per hour 3 units per hour so here if you see A is always open B and C are open for 1 hour each alternatively A and B are open alternatively that means in first hour A and B are working together in the second hour A and C are working together in the third hour A and B are working together and the fourth hour A and C are working together and so on so that means A and B together in first hour they can finish 9 units per hour ok A and B and next A and C will finish this one A and C will finish 8 units per hour 8 units per hour so that means in the first unit I, I mean in the first hour they are A and B together finishing 9 units in the second hour A and C finishing 8 units so that means in 2 hours that means in 2 hours we are finishing how many? 17 units in 2 hours we are finishing 17 units ok so multiply 3 on both sides that means in 6 hours we will finish 56 units in 6 hours we will finish 60 I mean 51 units so the total units are 60 and here we finish 51 units in 6 hours ok 6 hours the remaining units are how much 9 units ok so 9 units so on the first day A plus C is warm so on the 7th day also A plus C is going to be warm so A plus C I mean sorry A plus B A plus B is going to be work on the 7th hour because 6 hours are finished on the 7th hour A and B are going to be warm so A and B will finish 9 units per hour so that means in 1 hour they will finish the remaining 9 units so the total time taken to fill that one is 6 hours plus this 1 hour so the total actually the tank will be filled in 7 hours the tank will be filled in 7 hours so I hope you got this one thank you very much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel